to put you up on this guy, Donald Marshall. Um, he the one that I sampled the video content from that got over 82 point something thousand hits. And he is the one that is the grandfather of the cloning center's information. He said he has been cloned. He told about how Bernie Mac, how they killed Bernie Mac and made him have an aneurysm. And he says that they make a clone of you and they torture your clone and can make you have a heart attack. Traceable. They could clone you and keep bringing you back and torture you. His name is Donald Marshall. Here's some of the uh, content and then I'll continue commentating. World leaders and stuff own these things for pets. They all call it with uh, the secret of the grill, right? What they like to eat, the main thing that they like to eat is children. It's, uh, it's true because they don't have vaccinations. And uh, what they do is they like to scare their food too before they eat it because it gets adrenaline in them and uh, they taste better. And for those that want to research this topic, check him out. His name is Donald Marshall. And he speaks about the reptilian race called Vril. That's V R I L. Some spell it V R I L L. And it is a uh, worm symbolized by Yaudabo, the Gnostic god of this world, that brain parasites a human being. Yes, you have a, a type of fungi that parasites spiders, so you got those type of fungi that's brain parasite ants, some deers, where the real worm parasites the human brain and it goes within the left eye and takes over just like in the movie Get Out. But here's young Pharaoh speaking about the same topic. Check him out. Either we accept our own consciousness or we accept artificial intelligence. It's that simple. These people want to transfer their bodies into cyborgs so that they can be immortal. These are the type of people we deal with. See, a lot of the average person running around, you're stuck on police brutality. I don't care about racism at this point. Racism is a relief if that's all I had to deal with, but it's not. I'm dealing with people who can clone and torture and then transfer my consciousness back into the clone and do it again. I'm dealing with people who are masters in cybernetics and can create a drone that can kill my own family from their death. So the problem that we have allowed to evolve because we've been ignoring it, because we've been paying so much, so much attention to BET and entertainment and all kinds of stuff like that, is so scary because we've allowed it to become so big. And we have to deal with this problem because like anybody who knows anything about how militaries run, you know that might is right. And if might is right, somebody can force you to do the wrong thing because they have the might. We are allowing people to gain might, which will in turn allow them to give us bad influences for the rest of our life and probably all of eternity. Because if I can hook your mind up to a computer and assimilate your reality, who's to say I'll ever let you go?